Hey, ever wondered what's actually inside a robot hand? Like, how does it know not to crush things? How does it even... grip? Well, Boston Dynamics just gave us a behind-the-scenes look at Atlas's hands, and honestly, this is way cooler than I expected. They call it a gripper, but it's basically a robot hand with three fingers. And right away, you're probably thinking, wait, why only three? Here's the thing. Two fingers? That's just a pinch. You can grab a pen, maybe a cup, but three fingers? That's when things get interesting. Three fingers create a triangle, and that triangle is what stops objects from rotating or slipping out of the hand. It's literally the minimum number you need to hold something stable. Four fingers would just make everything more complicated and break more often. So three is the sweet spot. Same hand, picking up a paper cup, and now a heavy car part. How does it know not to crush the cup? These fingertips. They're made of this soft, squishy material, and they can actually feel. When the robot touches something, the fingertip squishes down. Sensors inside measure how much it's squishing, which tells the robot exactly how hard it's pressing. So when it touches that paper cup, it feels the resistance and thinks, okay, go easy. When it grabs the car part, it's like, all right, grip harder. It's real-time force feedback. The robot literally feels what it's holding and adjusts on the fly. If something starts to slip, the sensors detect it immediately and the robot tightens its grip. It's reacting faster than you could even process what's happening. These fingers can bend completely backward, all the way. Your fingers can't do that. 